The next stop in my Engage Maddening run is Corrin's Paralogue. The map is based on Chapter 6 from Fire Emblem Fates, and my team begins on an island in the middle of a river with only one bridge. I send my units down the right side of the map, starting things off by having Citrine blitz one of the nearby halberdiers. Unfortunately, she doesn't have Canter, so I have to burn a rescue charge to get her back to safety. Interestingly, there aren't actually that many enemies on the right-hand side. After the initial wave of halberdiers and snipers, I easily eliminate an advancing paladin, sage, and high priest. Then I make Corrin aggressive by having Alfred drop an astrostorm on a high priest in the right corner that represents Sakura. Corrin starts by vaporizing the river with a dragon vein. This allows the enemies from the left to reach me more easily, but they get distracted by Alfred's doubles, which I left on the central island on turn 1. The enemies representing the Nor Royals, along with the Griffin Knight representing Hinoka, form up around Corrin and advance to the right toward my team. Once they get close enough, I rush Corrin down. Her 4 HP bars pose a bit of a challenge, but Chloe and Citrine are both capable of dealing significant chip damage to set up the kill for an ally. With their firepower, plus a goddess dance from Saline and Byleth, I am able to take Corrin out in one turn.